Hey, what's up guys? It's Marlon here and I believe in focusing on the solution and not the problem. Before I begin, let me just explain what's going on here. It's freezing in my house and I'm really cold. So putting my hood up and having my hair cover my face actually keeps me really warm like a mean. So besides that, let's get to today's topic. I want to talk about being present in the moment and really trying to enjoy each moment right here, right now. Not worrying too much about the past and not stressing too much about the future. The reason I'm talking about this topic is over the weekend I had a chance to watch a film it's on Netflix. It's called Be Here Now. And it's the story of Andy Whitfield, which is the main actor in Spartacus, if anyone saw season one, great show. But when he came to a place where he was able to get the things he wanted in life, you know, he got the lead role of an amazing show that went all over the US and millions upon millions of views. He got the lead role. He, that was the acting role of his career. And things were starting to take off for him. People were contacting him and they wanted him to act in his their movies. As he got this, he also was diagnosed with cancer. And long story short, he did not make it. In this film, you see his entire journey and battle with cancer. And it's actually quite an amazing story because at no point did he ever really give up. He actually realized what it takes others an entire lifetime to figure out, which is to enjoy each moment right here and right now. Because tomorrow is not promised, and we hear it all the time. But it's so true, you really do have to figure out a way to enjoy each and every moment. And whether you're suffering, or whether you think you're at the lowest point in your life, you have to remember that how you choose to look at the situation creates the situation. This man got cancer and rather than thinking, oh man, like I have cancer, look at those guys outside playing basketball or running on the track or swimming in their pools. They could do that and here I am sitting with this terminally ill cancer. He was able to think of things like, you know what? I have the cancer but my children don't. I have to cancel, but my wife doesn't. I'm in a position to record my suffering and my story to show others and inspire them. So he turned what could have been the lowest point in his life into a highlight. It's a movie. And it's a very inspirational movie. I highly recommend you go and watch it. But really, that's all I wanted to tell you guys. I want to tell you, find a way to turn those moments into the greatest moments, every moment into the greatest moment of your life. Because if you actually stop and think about it, and really, I mean take a deep breath, stop, and actually think about it, there's a lot to be grateful for. Think of everything that you have. Think of all the opportunities you have had in the past, all the great things that have come to you. Even if you don't have it anymore, you already had it. You had those moments. You can be grateful for the fact that you have the memories that you had the opportunities, that you already had the experience and no one can take those from you. All right, so hopefully that resonates with some of you guys and turns your days positive, I don't know. And I'm gonna sign off now because I do have some video editing to do and I also need to get ready for work. So I'll see you guys later, I love you. If you're new here, just enjoy the content, it's free. If you don't like listening to it, the nice thing is you can just turn me off at any moment. Alright, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.